Welcome back to Stella Rated, the pet product review channel where I buy it and Stella tries it. This is the Kong Wild Elk Antler. It is a whole elk antler. If you are looking to buy an antler, some of them are large and they're split down the middle. The marrow is more exposed. Those don't last as long. This one is a large, it's recommended for 60 pounds and more and higher. And it is a naturally shed antler, which I think that means it's free range. So that's cool. Now, elk antlers are recommended for dogs to chew on because dogs like to chew on things and it supposedly cleans and freshens their breath, mostly by dislodging food that might be stuck in it. Still don't really understand how chewing on something incredibly hard is good for their teeth, but it is recommended by a lot of experts, so I'm sure it is. Now, the question is, as you see here, it's brand new in the package. How does Stella like it? And how long did it last? Because I've had varying degrees of success with antlers. One I bought from another brand that lasted a few hours, and one that didn't have a brand associated with it that I, I bought years ago that lasted months and months and months. But through editing, you'll find out right now. That's pretty much it. It's 100% natural, sustainable, naturally shed elk antlers, satisfies natural, natural chewing, satisfies natural chewing instincts, cleans and freshens breath. And obviously, obviously it's important to buy one that's the right size. If you buy one that's too small, it can become a choking hazard. If you notice it's getting too short, it might be time to throw it away and get a new one. Again, you don't want to get this or anything lodged in your dog's throat. This is a new channel you may have noticed. So if you haven't subscribed, please do. Please like, share, and comment. Something other than great video, let's build together, let's be YouTube friends, whatever that means. Oh, I'm not paying attention to the end screen. One of these is a video that I recommend or a playlist and the other one is a video that YouTube thinks you should watch. And of course, in the middle is the subscribe link. Looks like I need to get out of here. Like, I really need to get out of here.